Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Google is busy rolling out the early stable release of Google Chrome version 117, which is our next major version upgrade. And like most, I haven't received it yet because um, as many of you will know by now, the early stable rolls out to a limited subset of users a week prior to the version upgrade officially rolling out to the general public. So version 117, the early stable rolled out late yesterday in my region on the 6th. So we can expect version 117 to roll out to the general public starting the 12th or 13th next week um, of September 2023. Now the next version in bold will be 117.0.5938.48. And as mentioned, will be, be available to all users over the next week. Now because the version upgrade hasn't rolled out officially there are no release notes so as always just to give you a kind of um, expectation of more or less what to expect regarding features that um, google has been testing in the preview versions of google chrome that could possibly roll out with version 117 and this is by no means a comprehensive list and a complete list and could be subject subject to change so what we can expect to see is obviously over and above the bug fixes and the all important security fixes and those little under the hood tweaks and adjustments there are a couple of new features that could possibly be rolling out in chrome version 117. now the first is uh, the warning for potential malicious chrome extensions now i have posted on most of these new features we will look at today so if you want more uh, info just do a search on the channel so Chrome 117 will review unsafe extensions. And I posted on this around about the middle of last month, and I'll leave this video down below if you want more info. But starting in Chrome 117, Chrome will let you know when an extension you have installed is no longer in the Chrome Web Store, or if there are potentially unsafe extensions to review. And you can also enable this feature in the stable version currently using the extensions module in safety check flag and as mentioned go check that video out if you want more info and this is just a screenshot where um, it just gives us an idea of uh, in this example review two extensions that were taken down from the chrome web store so basically that's the new review unsafe extensions that could be rolling out next week in version 117 now moving on to the next and we are expecting once again to get some more material you visual redesign changes making their way down from the preview versions regarding the Chrome UI refresh for 2023. So for this, we're just going to head over to Canary and we are expecting some more um, icon changes from the toolbar and the navigation bar. And also, I think um, in version 117 next week, if we head to the main menu, we are going to see the iconography that's now available in Chrome Canary roll out to the stable version that distinguishes the different menu items and more padding between the menu items and also a clearer grouping of account specific options and you'll see here in chrome canary we get our profile with our account options and settings and basically specific options for your account and if we head back to the stable currently not available things looking a little bit different in the stable version in that main menu so material you changes um coming from chrome refresh 2023 we could I possibly expect to see roll out next week with version 117 and then just the last one to mention for the purpose of uh, this video if you just head over to my youtube channel uh, google is replacing the https secure icon which is this lock icon and sign here uh, in the address bar to the left of the url in the address bar and um, they are replacing it if we head back to chrome canary they are replacing that lock icon possibly with um, this kind of slider icon and although the icon has changed everything else more or less is exactly the same but the reason uh, google is changing this is they believe that the lock the lock icon is confusing for a whole lot of users as basically it gives the impression that the website they are viewing is reliable and um, this now is what uh, the slider kind of icon here to the left of the url um, is more or less what we could expect to see roll out and i have posted on all of these changes we have mentioned today so as mentioned if you want more info just do a search accordingly on the channel so that's more or less in regards to new features we can expect to see roll out with version 117 and as mentioned uh, 117 early stable has rolled out starting the 6th of september so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one